Hey guys, good morning. So welcome back to another weekly vlog and I'm about to go make some breakfast and I thought I would film it because today I'm attempting to make, well not attempting, I've made them before, um, saltfish fritters and I thought I would just show you guys. So saltfish fritters and um, the ingredients are pretty straightforward. <laughs> so enjoy the little cooking thing, relax. I know you guys find it very relaxing, so enjoy. All right guys, so as you guys saw, the batter is pretty much done. Um, the only thing is with making fritters, so once it's done, you're gonna only fry one to kind of see where you need improvement. Just fry one, so I'm just, just gonna drop one in the pot right now, just to kind of see if I need more salt, if I need more seasoning. So I'm only gonna fry one for now before I start frying the entire batter. All right guys, so this is the finished product of the fritter. Now we're just serving our breakfast. We're gonna have it with some ackee. We made this yesterday. I only gave you a bit, but put as much as you want. You know I'm greedy. So I'm gonna just pat on the ackee from the plate. So um, yeah, we're just gonna have this and then drink our tea. I'm having um, mint tea. What kind of tea are you having? English breakfast. She's gonna have English breakfast. I'm just gonna chill. Our, oh my God, the big box of uh, Tito's. <laughs> Disregard you guys. Disregard the Tito's. <laughs> Hi guys, so today's Thursday. I am dressed and ready to head into my office while well, my job to kind of like go scan a couple documents and stuff. Um, you know, and then I'm also have to go to a doctor's appointment. So this is basically my outfit right now. It's just a sweatshirt from Pretty Little Thing. Um, my necklace that I always wear. My hair's in a sleek bun today. Um, this over thing sweater, which is from Lulu's, and my Rothy's, which I haven't worn in so long, but I love them. And yeah, my little bag from Zara. So, so today's Friday. I picked out some loungewear clothes because I want to run out to the grocery store. Um, today I have to do like a major shopping, um, just to kind of re-up on some things. So I'm going to be wearing this tights from Express. 
believe it's from Express. Yep, tights from Express. This little shirt is from Pretty Little Thing. It's like their black set shirt. It looks a little bit like old-ish. Oh, it looks fine now. So that's my sweatshirt from Pretty Little Thing. And I'm going to be bringing this purse today from Zara. I like it because it just goes across my body and it stays pretty close to my body. And um, yeah, just going to bring this pouch from Zara, sunglasses, wallet, and yeah. So let's get dressed. Let's go get groceries. I chopped a couple of the veggies really roughly, as you can see. So there's onion, some thyme, pepper, red and green, and some carrots. Now I'm going to prep the meat. To be so this is what it's looking like right now. I am i don't know if I should put the carrots in now, but I'm just going to have it cook for like two hours without the carrots, then two hours with the carrot, then I add the potatoes and stuff. I have been a bad vlogger today, you guys, because I forgot to show you guys an update with the beef stew. Um, well, not much happened to be honest. It's just been sitting here, but so far I the beef is pretty much cooked I added some extra carrots and I added the potatoes So this is pretty much what it's looking like right now. My entire apartment smells like So good. It just smells like so homey Like you know when your grandmother is cooking or somebody's cooking your mom is cooking and everything just smells like cooked food that's what my my apartment smells like right now. So it's very, very good. If you guys can see in the gravy, there's a lot of herbs. So the thyme and everything is in here. And it just smells so like, so lovely. I love it so much. Hey guys, so today is Saturday. Um, I just finished filming a video installing um, my Desor hair. I think I showed you guys in my previous week vlog that I got this wig and I was gonna prep it for a wig video so finally filmed the wig video um it I did okay but the lace portion I feel like it's definitely a, a hassle like they're so difficult to like I mean I know it's not like you just put the thing there but I'm very concerned for like my because it sticks to like my face it really hurts like I don't really know if I want to be dealing with that so basically I just kind of like put it down to the side and I did some light glue there so yeah but I really like this cut to you guys like this little like medium bob I think it's very cute so yeah um I decided to name the wig Mitzi and um I basically prepped her and kept her on this wig head for a couple of days and um, I used the got to be glue and everything and um, to put it down. But yeah, and as I said before, I kind of feel like the hair on the wig is softer than the bundles. So yeah, the hair is like extremely soft. I love the little natural curls that it has. And um, I dyed it black, as I said before in a previous video. Like I dyed it black and I love this color. So yeah, um, again, the hair is from Desor Hair. Um, it's their 18 inch body wave wig. I have the 160 density. 
and I got the largest cap size, the wig size. I will have all the specs to this wig down below, so don't worry. And then, um, yeah, so the wig is from Desore Hair again, in case you guys are interested. I will have a code and all the info down below if you guys are interested, but yeah. <sighs> this is what it looks like right now. So basically for the day, I'm just going to be relaxed, and I do have a couple videos to edit, but it's pretty much my plans for the day. And Hey guys, so it's Saturday still. Um, I think I spoke with you guys earlier when I showed you the wig, but it's Saturday and um, I actually did a full, I did a whole sewing. Um, my leave out is up top here and, um, but now I'm making dinner. I'm gonna be making beef for broccoli and some white rice. So I'm gonna go to the kitchen and show you guys how we do that. And then after that, we're basically gonna end off the vlog. Also, I noticed that I didn't show you guys the finished product for the beef stew, so I'm sorry about that, but it was bomb. Good morning. As you guys saw, I just made some coffee. Today is Monday, 8.19 currently. And um, I should have been up an hour ago because I do have, I have to film a video before nine o'clock because at 9.15 I have to go on a call for work, work, work. I get ready right now because I have to film and I'm literally gonna do the quickest makeup ever. Like ever in my life. The quickest 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 makeup so I'm just going to put some makeup on you guys can chill here if you want So I just stopped my makeup for one second because I really wanted to show you guys how I just love these Fenty um, concealers. Thanks to Courtney for recommending me and putting me on because these, oh my God, these are just so beautiful. I love it.
Okay, so my makeup is done. Did something really simple. Um, I just noticed that there's construction across the street and I don't really know if it's gonna be annoying in my video Also my hair. I did my own sew on Saturday night I believe I you guys saw when I just had finished it and I didn't film it again Oh my goodness. I keep forgetting to film. I just do it so fast and I, it's just like a muscle memory Like I used to do my weaves myself a long time ago So I just know how to like do the same braid pattern and I know how to sew it in and I love doing my own weaves because I make it so flat and I feel like when you go to the hairdressers and stuff They just don't really have the patience to be braiding your hair that small But I do it for myself because I like my sewings flat And I promise when I take out this weave and I do it again, I'm going to film I promise I just Sometimes you just be sitting down doing stuff and it's just too much work to go set up a camera, you know? So I apologize, but you guys are gonna see me do this weave one day on my channel. It's really not, not that hard. If you know how to braid, you'll be good. Cause that's really the hardest part, braiding your hair down. The sewing part is very easy. All right, I'm about to go get ready now, but the lighting doesn't look too bad. It's kind of gray, but I might use the ring light to kind of even out the light to kind of see what's going on. Let me try. Okay. I can work with that. Okay, I'll catch you guys later. All right guys, you've reached the end of this vlog. Um, this vlog was very um, chaotic. I honestly just pieced together bits and pieces of my day. Um, I really wasn't vlogging very consistently for a weekly vlog, so didn't really have that much footage to work with, but you've reached the end. I'm going to be uploading this vlog today. But yeah, um, I return to work tomorrow and I'm very excited about it. Um, you know, life is slowly come, um, returning to normal and I'm very excited for it. But you know what? As unfortunate as this COVID-19 thing was, it definitely gave me a break. A break to kind of like rest and like figure some things out and all of that so I'm grateful just the same you know but I'm very excited to return to work but during quarantine it definitely gave me a taste of what it would be like if I were a full-time youtuber full-time influencer and all I can say about that is I don't really know if that's for me <laughs> I like doing both things I like having you know two things being busy with both you know i like having that i like my life how it was like having youtube as like a little side thing and then my main job definitely preferred that a lot more i don't really know about this full-time influencer thing because you know but you know everything is not for everybody so it's completely fine returning to work back to my normal life so you know uploading every day and all that fun stuff i may not be able to do that as much anymore but i'm definitely going to be still very consistent you guys know me like i'm i don't play that okay so um yeah as always you guys thank you so much for watching i just wanted to come on here and just say this quick bit and i hope you guys are keeping safe and um i will basically see you guys in my next video which will most likely be tomorrow but you know just wanted to say that all right guys have a great day happy sunday and i will see you soon